is not, I don't know why. Who I thought I was, I was drinking limoncello last night and I'm now moving on a hangover. Welcome. This is my empty house tour. We're at home. So this is in, here's producer Martin. Just looking cute. Um, yeah, here we go. Empty house tour, moving day. So you have a gorgeous little tiled entrance and to your right is a nice little bathroom with a shower. And that is what we will call, ladies and gentlemen, the Pulu. So anyone that comes over, that's where we do the number twos. And then on this side is all the nice storage for so pram and shoes and a little utility. Oh, more storage. Okay. Oh, there it is. Washer dryer. Oh, yeah, this is cool for the long coats. Fab. So that's that. And then you come through here and it's all open plan. So you come down, here's the kitchen. Gorgeous little kitchen. Somewhere here is a dishwasher. I mean, that is gonna be a game changer. I have not had a dishwasher for years. So that's a little kitchen space. Cute. And then you come out and I suppose this area here is probably like the dining room-ish there so you come um about there and i'm gonna put probably here like my table and chairs here and then the kitchen is just there so come and eat because i like to eat at a table and chairs and then on the other side is the living room look how big and open it is it's like loads of wonderful open space nice white walls big windows so yeah, I'm going to enjoy filling this room with, I need some new stuff. I want to get new furniture. I want like new sofas and I want like cool rugs. So yeah, I'm really inspired by the space, which is great. And then here, which is one of the big selling points, it's locked. Let me get the key. And then, ta -da! got some outside space. Oh, how nice. I mean, imagine if I was here in lockdown, I would have loved my life. And if we have to go into like local lockdown again, oh, I have outside space in London. Yeah, it's amazing. Thinking of getting maybe a little hot tub going, some sort of like cool action. Like I feel like this is my area. So yeah, very excited about that. And then back through here, Lovely open space, and then upstairs. I'm protecting the oh. What's that? Fire alarm, maybe? Yeah, but it's in there. So you come up the stairs, and then you basically got the landing, and then it's off to the bedroom. So I don't know which one's the master bedroom yet. So they're all pretty standard. Again, wood floors, white walls, you really can't go wrong. I feel like this is probably the biggest. Yeah. So I think this will be like the master for the master. And then Zeke's gonna have his very own bedroom. How amazing. And I'm gonna get his cot. And then this is a smaller room. And this room actually has the boiler. It's a nice airing cupboard, keep my towels warm. And then a little, oh, what's that thing then? That's the boiler, what's that thing? Oh, I have no idea. <laughs> I have no idea what that is, ladies and gentlemen, not a clue. Maybe a hot water tank? Who knows, I actually don't know. But this is probably gonna be like dressing room, get some like, I could turn this into like a walk-in wardrobe. I don't think it would fit all of my crap, but I could try, which is fun. And then finally, the upstairs bathroom, which is very simply where I have my daily bath. Again, right, <laughs> you shut the door Woo, and breathe. And that's it guys, this is my new house. So really excited to like be creative, and just decorate it. I'm gonna buy loads of new stuff. 
I've got a table and chairs, which if I've got time, she says, I'm gonna like sand it down and make it look really cool and vintagey. So yeah, watch this space. Moving day on a limoncello hangover. Don't know who I think I am. Ciao.